As pet owners, we notice that our pets have peculiar mannerisms and rabbits are no exception. Rabbits exhibit many behaviors that we may find strange. A common behavior you may notice is how rabbits rub their chins on objects, places, people, and even other rabbits. But why do rabbits rub their chins on everything? What is so special about rabbits' chins? Here are five reasons for this unique behavior. What is chinning? Rabbits rubbing their chins on areas and objects is called chinning. The general idea why rabbits perform chinning is to mark their territory. Rabbits are territorial creatures, and chinning is the quickest, most common way to leave their marks on areas, objects, and even people. Marking their territory. Returning to the general notion as to why rabbits perform chinning, they use it to mark their territory. Rabbits are very territorial animals and use odor to identify territory. Rabbits leave their scent behind areas they claim as theirs, such as sleeping areas, certain areas of their cage, and even the area where they eat. To rabbits, having their own space is very important. Just because your rabbit marked a specific area does not necessarily mean you or other animals in the house can trespass. This simply allows them to relax, knowing they are in an environment they can call home. Navigation. Aside from marking their territory, rabbits may use chinning to navigate new areas. You may find your rabbit chinning different places and objects when placed in a new area or environment. They use these set markers as means of familiarizing themselves with the environment when exploring, telling them where they've been and where they haven't been. You can see this behavior if you and your rabbit just moved houses. You might find your rabbit exploring while also leaving its mark. Looking for a natural way to improve your pet's health and happiness? Look no further than BMix Pets Upgraded Wild Alaskan Salmon Oil. Whether you have a dog, cat, or any other furry friend, this oil can help promote health benefits, such as a shiny coat, joint health, heart and brain health, and improve your pet's immunity. Simply add a few drops to your pet's food or apply topically as needed. Try it today and see the amazing benefits for yourself. Claiming property. You may find your rabbit chinning on objects and food. Aside from areas, rabbits can also claim objects as theirs. You may find that they chin on objects such as toys, shoes, or random objects lying around that they can easily find. Marking objects simply means that your rabbit finds comfort and security in the object. It can also mean that they find the object interesting, and leaving their mark can make it easier for them to find it and explore it at a later time. Food is also considered an important property of rabbits. You may find that rabbits stake claims to food by rubbing their chins on them, especially if there is more than one rabbit in the household. Rabbits do not like to share food. To display affection. We've discussed rabbits marking and claiming areas and objects as their own, but what does it mean when your rabbit rubs against you? When marking territory and property, you, as the owner, may fall within that category. Your rabbit spends considerable time around you as their rabbit parent, and chinning on you suggests that you belong to them. Rabbits have a very sensitive smell and can detect differences in scents, even when your human nose doesn't notice it. You may find your rabbit chinning you again after you take a bath when its scent is no longer detected. To establish dominance. You can also find rabbits chinning other rabbits. If you own multiple rabbits of the same sex, you may catch them chinning each other to assert their dominance. This behavior is more common in male-male pairs. Eventually, the struggle for dominance ends with one rabbit bowing its head toward the winner of the struggle. Chinning will no longer be observed, but you'll find one rabbit dominant over the other. This does not necessarily mean that they won't become close over time, but there is a clear social hierarchy present in the rabbit world. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.